Lawrence, congratulations. Thank His you. History tonight, Britain's first ever European Championship medal in the, the discus. It obviously meant a great deal to you. No, it was, it was massive for me. Um, you know, I've uh, had a tough season in a, in a lot of ways, and um, to back up the Commonwealth silver with a, a medal in the Europeans, which is basically the standard of the Olympics, you know, got all the top, you know, top eight of the world here. Uh, to do that and beat these guys and get a bronze um, is massive for me and my and my development. You know, obviously, I want to really fulfil my potential in the sport. I haven't done that so far, but this season, this last few weeks, have been a massive breakthrough, and I'm hoping I can uh, carry it on to bigger things. What do you put the breakthrough down to? That obviously things clicked tonight as well. What's happened to to bring about the change? Um, you know, I was injured uh, earlier this season. I pulled my hamstring twice and I hurt my ankle. So, you know, I, I, it kind of derailed me a lot. I had some poor performances and I wasn't able to get it right. You know, um, you know I did a lot more work with my coach and tried to find, you know, some mental clarity. You know, I was a bit down on myself and my self-belief was low. But, you know, I just kept training and, and everybody knew I could get the big throw if I just got it right. And, uh, you know, I worked a lot on my mentality and I was able to uh, progress a little bit. Um, I was extremely disappointed in the world champs, you know, coming 13th. I knew I had a massive throw in me there. Um, so I just kind of used that fuel to, to, to focus and get better. And uh, hopefully I can continue to get better as the, the years go on. Yeah, you're someone who burst onto the scene, you know, 10 years ago, um, you know, making making headlines and you've been away from the sport and, and to come back. Is it even more special now that you've returned? Oh, massive, massive. Because, uh, you know, when I came back uh, to Discus, I had a torn groin, you know, I had a hernia, you know, I could barely walk, it took me a year to get back to normal and then I had the COVID year so I couldn't really compete and then last year in the Olympics to foul out in the uh, in the uh, qualifying so I had like disappointment after setback after disappointment so to uh, rise up from there and to, to do this today it's um, you know it means the world to me so I mean I, and I can't rest here I have to keep getting better because the field is so good it's historically great to be honest with you uh, these guys are unbelievable so um, if I want to keep getting medals in, in the comps to come, I have to keep improving. Yeah. Can you put into words what a good throw feels like? How you, you it feels know. smooth. It feels smooth and it feels like you got all your energy in. And sometimes it doesn't feel like you got all your energy in. It still goes far. So it's just a matter of uh, trying your best and trying to be focused and, and move fluidly and hopefully it comes out right. And that medal winning throw tonight, you, you knew it was good, didn't you? Yeah, I knew it was good straight away. That's, I guess all discus throws, no, all throws in general know when it's a good throw. And uh, it felt great straight away. And um, you know, I was just glad I got out there.